How's it going, everybody? Obi here, and welcome to Bermuda Lost Survival. Okay, guys, so basically, this is a brand new survival game based around the Bermuda Triangle. Now, if you don't know what that is, it's a place in the ocean where ships and airplanes and people just keep getting lost. So we're going to jump into this. Uh, I don't know what to expect. Uh, let's go ahead and hit new game here and see what happens. Oh, okay, just like that, we are tossed into a raft. We could sleep. Uh, we got, we could grab this stuff. We can grab that. We can use that. Uh, I don't know what the use key is. Oh, it's F, I think. Looks like F is the use key here. Ooh, okay. This reminds me a little bit of Stranded Deep. I never played it, but I watched people play it a lot. Um, can we, can we hop in the water? Is that, is that a good idea? Hello? Oh, what is that back there? Is that a shark? Is that a shark too? Okay, we're getting out of the water. Get out of the water, climb. Okay. Okay. Note to self, never go back in water ever again. Wait, what do I what do? I do? <laughs> oh, I got a hammer. My boys, I got a hammer and a knife. Eh. No, 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 don't cut that, dude. Jeez, don't cut the rack, my boy. This is air inside of here, I think. Okay, tab. Oh, but it's this. We can upgrade our knife. I see a level 10 knife right here. It's an improved one. Axe, spear, bottles, coming soon. Okay. We got artifacts here, achievements, abilities. So a lot of this stuff is still coming soon. If you look at the top left corner there, we are still in early access here. So we don't have a lot of things available to us just yet. However, I guess we have to start doing some things. I'll grab some cans. I'll grab a first aid. And I guess I'll jump on in the water and start like... Oh my goodness gracious. I don't know what I'm doing. I guess we got to go down here. Um, do I have a breath meter? I don't know. Okay, if you look at it right there, the top right icon seems to be some kind of breath meter. I believe that is going down very slowly. Harvest this. We harvest it with F, I think. Good a shadow. Oh! The, 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 oh, the, the, the grass scared me, yo! Okay, just slice it. Okay, we harvested some seaweed here. Don't really know what I'm gonna be doing with seaweed. Um, ooh, what's this stuff over here? Harvest this. Luminous coral. Maybe we can eat that, I don't know. I'm no survival expert, my boys. I, I just, I do what I do, okay? We don't need that, we don't need that. I am so scared of the water, guys. If y'all saw my Subnautica playthrough, man, I did not handle that well at all. Oh, is it coming for me? Does it see me? Dude, I don't want any problem. I got a knife, bro. I will stab you in the face. Yeah, you better back out of here, bro. Ooh, there's like a sunken ship down there. Oh, there's a lot down here. Now, how big is this game? Is my question. Like, how far out in the ocean can I actually go? I don't know yet. Anyways, we got some materials here. Let's open up the inventory and see. Uh, Seaweed is a basic crafting material. And so is luminous coral. But what can I craft with it? Um, maybe a bottle? Okay, look at the bottom right corner there. It tells you what we need. So for a bottle, we need five scrap metal, two sticks, and one rope. I have to imagine that stuff's pretty easy to obtain. What about a level 10 knife? I don't know. Uh, I think we need level 10? Uh, what? Oh, okay, okay. Now we're getting into it. If I open up the box on the raft, I can drag my materials in here and actually start to craft things. However, we need planks and sticks. How do I get sticks? Ain't nobody knows. Okay, let's close that up for now. Let's jump back into the water here. And we're gonna go look for some sticks here. Maybe, where's that ship at? There it is, right there, right down there. Covered by sharks and stuff. They don't seem hostile, but then again, I haven't really taken the time to put my face into a shark. And I always say, if you don't know if something's hostile, put your face into it and find out right away. I don't ever say that. And I would recommend never doing that. Oh, okay. Just grab the wood. Grab the planks, my boy. We're getting lots of planks here, okay? That's gonna help us a lot in our adventures in the water. What is that? Harvest. I got sticks. That was a stick. Okay, we got sticks. That is a good start to my survival. Sticks are important in any survival game. Absolutely. Look at all these sticks down here, my boys. Grab those. That's two. That's one right there, I think. 
There was three sticks, I think. No, plus one. I got plus one sticks, so I have three in total. What? Okay, we got a lot of planks. We got a lot of sticks. We got six planks, seven planks, four sticks. Did he grab it? We gotta get air. Four sticks. Get out of here, dude. Go. Oh, oh, don't tell your shark friend about that, please. Now I'm hoping later down the line, maybe we can get some kind of equipment like flippers and help us swim a little faster. Cause right now we are going up at a dull pace. Okay, we got air, we got air. We got the air. Get on the ship here. The ship, <laughs> the raft. Use the crafting box. Put the planks in here. Drag that. Ooh, okay. Drag that in there. Now, can I craft anything? I need that many planks and sticks for one little wooden platform? Are you kidding me? Man. We're going to have to make several dives down here to start getting some things built, yeah? That's okay. Rome wasn't built in a day, and neither is OB's base. Can I paddle? I want to paddle. I want to go out. Eh. Eh. Whoops. Okay. Well, let's go back down. Let's haul over some materials. Should I attack a shark? Is that stupid? Should I try it? Little dude? Hey, look. My name's OB. I'm going to stab you a couple times just to see what happens here. I do mean harm. Okay, he's swimming pretty fast. This dude, I'm gonna catch this dude off guard. I'm trying to catch up with him right here. What up, dude? Hey, he's swimming away too. You scared, bro? You scared me, bro? Yeah, you baby scared, little bro. Oh, he's turning right before we did. This is exactly what I want here. Come here, bro. Get, get. Are the sharks really afraid of me? Well then, I am the king of the ocean. Man has conquered ocean at last. Go me. Sadly, I did waste a lot of my breath chasing sharks. So I don't have a lot of time to grab these sticks here. Um, I'm already starting to drown in a little bit here. Ooh, now, whoa, that is dark. That is dark? Oh. Okay, okay, hold on. I'm gonna get some breath. I'm gonna go up and get some breath here. And we gonna swim out there, guys. Oh my goodness, it is too dark. I am so terrified right now. Oh, oh, oh. It's okay. It's okay. Get the air. Get the arrow B. We're doing it. Oh, that is the scariest thing I've ever seen in my life. Can you guys imagine like a shark like that big? Just the whole ocean just lunging towards like the screen right now. My boys? Are you guys with me here? I am so scared right now. You have no idea. My heart is pounding. Oh. Should I go up? We get some air. Okay, so from my understanding here, it looks like there's probably nothing out there. So maybe it's a waste of time to swim too far. Because this guy swims really slow. Oh, wow. Maybe there is something out there. Ah, uh, that's a big part of the map. No, no, no. What we got to do is play this smart, okay? We got to play for survival here. Where's my raft? Uh-oh. Is that over there? I thought it's not. There it is. Straight ahead. Straight ahead. Okay. Let's gather some materials. Let's start getting the foundation of a base built. We got to do something in this episode that's going to be meaningful here, okay? And I think getting a base started is going to be our best choice here. Ooh, what is this right here? I'm grabbing some stone. We're finding stones on the bottom of the ocean here. Okay, that's pretty good. I have to imagine having a lot of stone is going to be important later on. But we need more wood. We need more wood. We need planks. We need rope. There's so much we need and there's so much I don't know how to get yet. Like, what is this stuff? What is the seaweed for? I don't know. My boys, check this out down there. There's some kind of crates we could probably loot. I need to get some oxygen first. Um, I am suffocating here. Oh, I'm drowning, rather. I need to go back down there, though. I need to loot that. What are those? What are those oil barrels? What in the world? What happened in this ocean? Okay, here we go. Next to the crates. Harvest it. Do I hit it? It has a big X on it. Can I not harvest this yet? Maybe I need to hit it with a hammer? Deconstruct. Deconstruct. Uh, I don't understand. Maybe I can't open these just yet. However, there are a lot of planks down here and sticks, which we both all know we need right now. Okay, guys, if you look over here to the right, I got just enough materials for some uh, building stuff here. Now, uh, a drying rack would be pretty good. We can dry out harvested seaweed and make rope out of it. So that's pretty good. Um, what else? What is this? Like, uh, this is a workbench over here. Okay. We need something for, like, water. You know, collect water, rainwater, stuff like that. Like, right now, 
I'm a little bit concerned because I have no idea how to get water. We have these cans, which provides hunger and thirst increasing, but I don't know how to get water. Like, how do I make water? <laughs> I need to distill it somehow. Anyways, let's get a wooden platform. Let's craft this bad boy. Let's craft it here at the bottom right. You can clearly see it is almost done. It is now done. Take it out of the box, put it in my hands, and is it getting nighttime? Don't tell me the sun actually goes down. Well, that wouldn't make sense. Wait, that's the moon. That's the sun. Oh, boy. It's going to get really creepy in a moment, isn't it? Oh, jeez. Oh, check this out, guys. So the hammer is used for crafting. So if I take out the hammer, I can craft a wooden plank. Um, I, I guess this is what we'll have to do here. Try to get a straight, yeah? Right there, maybe? Bah. Okay. Well, it's stable. Don't ask me how. But we got a pretty stable platform here. It's floating in the middle of the ocean. Yeah. That, this raft right here? That's just all over the place, yo. But that? That's look good. Ooh, we got a drink, huh? Oh, just like that, I drink and ate. Okay. I used one of my cans, though. Look down here. Clearly, we don't have a lot left. And there is, there is a medicine uh, health first aid thing here. So you have to assume there's something down there that will attack you and do damage to you. It has to be the sharks. I think I've just been getting lucky so far. Okay, so I'm gonna go back down here and start grabbing some more supplies. Stones are gonna be needed here. Absolutely. I'm gonna grab some of the seaweed here so we can start making some rope out of that later on here. I already got 19, 20 of them. It's two per slice here, so that's pretty awesome here. I don't know what this is for yet, but I'll grab some just in case. Maybe this is how we get water, I don't know. Looks like little cups here. Maybe we can like aim them to the sky and fill them up with some rainwater if that's a possibility. I don't know. Okay. I just want more water, please. Guys, look at that. You can see the moon back there from underwater. I thought that was a giant jellyfish coming at me. Kind of spooked me a little bit. Okay. Well, let's go craft some, uh... Oh, it's getting real dark. Climb, climb, get on top of this. I feel so alone right now. You have no idea. I guess I could sleep the night away, but I really don't want to do that if I don't need to. Um, I would like to spend my night getting materials and things that I need, yeah? Maybe, just maybe, we should try to go for like a workbench. Uh, at a workbench, you can process scrap metal. It contains blueprints for additional structures and stations. So that might be something pretty important to go for here. Uh, clearly, we don't need a, a crafting box. We to have one of those. I think uh, drying rack might be pretty good to go for so we can start making rope. All we need for the drying rack is planks and sticks. Um, okay. I already have the planks that I need. I just need 12 sticks. Let's go back down and get 12 sticks real quick. Oh, it is so dark. Oh, it is so dark. Eh. Oh, well. Wow, it is getting really dark down here, though. Like, it's darker than usual. Absolutely. If the giant sea monster came out right now, I would scream. At the top of my lungs. But don't worry. I will lower the volume. So you guys don't get jump scared. Oh. So I'm finding a lot of stone. But sadly I'm not finding any sticks. Which is uh. Desperately what I want right now. Look more stones everywhere. Where the sticks at? Yo there's one. There's a stick right here. Ooh sticks everywhere. Over here. Stick paradise. I found the paradise of sticks. Give me that. Give me that. I need it. Give me that one. I want that one. I want this one. Give me those sticks, please. Okay, guys. I think I got enough sticks here. Uh, I didn't really check. Uh, I need a 12. I got eight, but I need air. Yes, darn it. That's the problem about surviving in the water, guys. You always need air. You can't just freely loot what you want, you know? Get air. Go back down. Rinse and repeat. And let's see how dark it is. Super dark. The sun is still kind of up over there. Gives me a little bit of hope. The moon, however, it's up there. Absolutely. Okay, guys. So I get all the sticks that I need. I believe we're going back to the raft to climb aboard. Let's go ahead and jump onto my newly made platform here and hit the tab screen. Wait, I need my crafting box. Open it in there. Okay. Put the wood in here. You probably take the seaweed out. Put the planks in here. Take the luminous coil out. Okay. Let's go ahead and make a drying rack. Boom, bop. Boom, it is crafting, as you can clearly see here. Okay, we're doing it. 
put that over there. Go ahead and grab out the hammer. And where do I... Ah. Okay. Just like that. No. Uh, whoa, 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 whoa. What way does it go? Like this? Is it straight? My heart's pounding. Oh, I'm drowning. I mean, I'm not drowning. Uh, I need I need a drink. Um, eh. Grab that. Got some supplies here. Put it on your hot bar. Hurry. My heart is pounding so loud. There we go. I am no longer in danger of dehydration. Okay. Use this. Uh, put that on there. And run it. I made eight rope. Oh, it's making eight rope. What if I put this on there too? I don't know. Uh, am I ready? For, am I ready for that kind of gameplay yet? Whoa! Look at my little rope, dudes. Make a rope out of seaweed. How do I get more water? That is like my number one question right now. Like, I want to sleep because making YouTube videos when a game is at night like this, it's really hard for you guys to see, probably. Um, but at the same time, the night is so cool, isn't it? Let's go ahead and try sleeping now. Uh, oh, I can save the game. I saved it. Oh, <gasps> that's how you save. Oh, so, okay, so the game has been saved. How do I sleep though? Oh, oh, you just crank it up. Okay, we're gonna sleep to like right there. We're gonna rest for eight hours here. Okay. And now what we're gonna do is something a little bit crazy here. We're gonna swim out, my boys. Okay, the game is saved. So if I die to some kind of like monster shark attack or something like that, we are in no fear of, you know, losing or anything like that. Okay, guys, so I'm grabbing a ton of supplies here and we're just gonna grab it all. We're gonna use a little bit of it right now. Get my water, my thirst up a little bit. We're full up. We're going to jump in and we're just going to swim, okay? We're just going to swim and see what happens. Okay, guys. So I've been swimming for a little bit now, about three minutes actually. And uh, we're still not seeing anything out here. It's very barren. Not a single creature is out in this water here. If you open up the map, you can see I didn't really make it very far. You don't swim very fast in this game here. But uh, I want to get to at least like another little hexagon right here. You know, see what... See what a new zone would look like, maybe? I don't know. Okay, everybody, if you look at the top right of the screen there, we are coming up to some kind of shadow on the radar here. We're getting close to another hexagon being unlocked, I think. Still nothing underwater. Okay, gonna go back up a little bit. Oh, yeah, you can see we might... We actually... We hit it right on the corner here, so we're gonna unlock two hexagons, I think. I think that's how that works. I have no idea. We're gonna find out soon, I guess. Okay, guys, here we go. We are right at the corner. We're about to tip into it. Come on! Swim, little dude! Kick your little feet down, man! Come on! Let's go! Jeez Louise, this guy swims so slow! Is it gonna unlock? Hello? I am in uncharted territories now. Oh, jeez! It's way deeper! Oh! Oh! Wait. Should I go? Should I go down? I'm kind of curious now. If you guys are not scared of this, you are some brave people out there. Oh, are we going under the world? No, wait. No, come on. No. Game, no. This is another ocean down here. Okay, there's one, there's one ocean floor. <laughs> okay. 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 So this right here, there's still ocean floor down here. You guys can definitely probably not see this, but I can see a little bit of grain here. We are seeing a shadow from the floor above us hitting down. So now, obviously, I'm going to drown, but I saved the game, so I'm not too concerned here. We're going to start swimming underneath the world. Okay. This is creepy. So if I try to go up, Will I hit the bottom of the other sand or will I hit? Well, no, I popped right out of it. So can I go through it? No, the bottom of it has coll no collision, but like right here, you can't go through it. I don't know what this has to do with any of the gameplay, guys. I'm just curious. Now I want to know what happens if I drown. Okay, I'm learning. We're taking it one day at a time. So if I go out even further, will the ocean drop off again? Will I ever find another monster out here? So many questions. So unanswered. And here we go, guys. We're about to drown here. I am so excited for my first drowning occasion. I'm doing it. Look at my health bar on the bottom right. It is drastically going down here. Oh, actually, I got a question here. 
Can I? I can bandage up while drowning to survive even longer. Nito, I was all curious about it. Here we go, here we go, we're dying. Woo! I was about to knees. Woo! -hoo. Good job. Good job, everybody. We did it. We survived in the ocean. Ooh. Does that mean my stuff is done? Let's use this. My rope is done. See? Drowning in the ocean has some benefits here. We got to, we got to uh, drown and, you know. Do I lose my inventory? Oh. Well, what did I really lose? Some seaweed and some luminous coral. I want to get some coral. I want to put it on a rag and see if that does anything. Getting myself some luminous coral. Going on the bottom of the ocean floor. There's a wrap up here for safety. The shark's over there for danger. Grabbing myself some coral. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, I have to imagine eight corals is probably enough. I'm also gonna go after a shark again, okay? I'm gonna go face to face with a shark. I'm gonna force the shark to bite me or get stabbed by me. Okay, it's not gonna have an option here. I'm gonna stick my knife in its face and whatever happens, happens, okay? We, we do, we're just gonna do it now. Why now? What is that out there? Like a submarine or something? My boys? Do you see that big thing out there? Is that just a rock? Oh. The rock. I thought it was like a submarine or something. Okay, here it goes. Well, dude, he turns away! What kind of shark in the ocean in any video game ever does that? Okay, I'm over here trying to get bit by a shark and I'm struggling. I'm struggling! There he is! What up, dude? Ugh. Please! Bite me, please! Well, gosh darn it. Let's go turn my corals into, um, stuff. Okay, let's see if I can do this. It, uh, doesn't do anything, actually. So I think the drying rack is literally just for seaweed. Interesting. And it doesn't appear there's anything else I can really craft here. I mean, a workbench, but any scrap metal, which I don't know how to get yet. Well, okay, guys, I think we're going to go ahead and call the gameplay here. Uh, we didn't get a lot done here, but we did get to jump in a little bit. Explore the ocean. You know, we got we got the good basics down here. We got a good feel for the game. I might actually take to the forums and see what other people are doing right now and how they're surviving out here. Because I'm a little bit at a loss here. I really don't know how to get fruit and water yet. Um, maybe it doesn't exist in the game. Maybe it's just not in the game yet. That's a huge possibility here. But uh, yeah, let's go back to the main menu real quick. Let's exit to the menu. Yeah, look at this, guys. Okay, so in the next update. We're gonna have, they're gonna be adding enhanced tools, increasing the playable area, and improving the game balancing. Later on, they're gonna have consumable items, new resource types, new crafting recipes, and new stations, and then even further, tiger sharks and poisonous jellyfish. So that's gonna be pretty cool, adding a lot of things to the game. It was good to see that developers have big plans for it, because I think this could be something really special. But yeah, guys, as I said earlier, we're going to go ahead and call this one here. So I hope y'all enjoyed this episode of Bermuda Lost Survival. If you did, make sure to hit that thumbs up button. And I'll see all you cool guys in the next one. And bye-bye.